All right. <clears throat> well, let's go. Let's do it again. RNG will be a little bit kinder to us. Guess we'll have to see, though. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. Da -na -na -na. Baby's first shield. Well, that works for a first item. It's actually something useful besides a piece of gosh dang candy. Or whatever it was last time. And that guy's gonna eat shit. Didn't drop anything for me, but we'll see what the tree pull is. Please be something other than arrows. Ooh, full magics. Wow. All right, then. I mean, not terribly useful. I would have preferred bombs, but eh. Can't be that picky. Uncle, what's in your pockets today? A piece of candy. Gosh dang it. <laughs> He's got to stop carrying around those Werther's Originals. What a shit. All right, what about here, though? The hammer! Oh, goodness me. Another early hammer. Wow, that is something. That is really something. What about the church? What's the church got for us? A piece of candy. Well, <laughs> that's kind of not great. <laughs> oh, dear. Wow, early hammer, though. Really nice. It gives us a very reliable weapon right from the start. How about a bomb drop, though? No? No bomb drops? No busy bam drops? Hmm. That might change our route a little bit here. Uh, does that change the tree pole? No, it's still, it's still magic. What about the crab drop? What's the crab got for us? Ah, uh, just hearts. You ass. If the crab can ever drop bombs for us. It'd be really nice. What's on Lumberjack Ledge? The blue mail. All right, well, not terribly, I mean, useful, but not terribly important to make us do egg at one if we don't have to. So we're not gonna. We're not gonna, we're just gonna mark it off and be done with it. I could really use some roots or some bombs. Either either of those would be really nice. Fifty roots, okay. That get, that gets us some bombs. Fifty roots gets us some bombs. How about Thieves Den has a mirror? Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Early mirror. Alright. Alright, that's that's it's it's a good start. It's a good start. It's a good, it's a real nice start. I want some bombs. No? Arrows? Alright. No. I want arrows. Alright, well it's off to the shop to grab some bombs before we start clearing the village here. Just fuck double dipping into these sections here. We just drop by the old tavern. What did they make last night? <laughs> they only made 20 bucks. Oh, it must have been a slow night. Okay. All right, we are free to clear everything else out now. Chicken throw, can we get a good chicken throw like we did last time? Nope. Turfed it right on the wall. What a piece of candy in the old KFC today. for bottle vendor just yet. If we could get a nice, like, a clean three hundo in the well or the... or blind set, that would be really nice. Really good start. Big old 20 there. Yeah, 
piece of candy there. Oh, that was number four? I thought that was number three. I had a bad count. Oh, early power glove. Piece of candy. And a forward work container. Okay. <clears throat> early glove is really nice. So we've got good attack. We've got some lift. And we've got the mirror. Now, if we get... Oh, if we get Moon Pearl, we've got super early Dark World, which is really great, but I don't know that we'll necessarily get it. Oh, there's a clean and clear three hundo. Arrow cap, not as exciting. Hard container, pretty nice at this point. And a sword, early sword, five and a half in. And we got ourselves a sword. And another... <laughs> Okay, <laughs> okay. Another sword, all right. Let's see, it's all right, it's a good start. It's really good, okay. <laughs> How about another sword from the bottle vendor? Dang, only bombs. <laughs> Damn, oh man. All right, that's okay, it's okay. We're good, we're good here. That's really good. Man, all right, so the only thing keeping us from Dark World now is the Moon Pearl. But the rest we kind of got covered here. What's in the library? Nothing but some arrow caps. A six minute butter, oh man. Can you imagine? Can you imagine how crazy that would be? Butter sword at six minutes. Would have been nuts. Nothing but a fiver on. A little race game. So nothing that we really care about right now. So let's hit up South Shore. The dam, two items at the dam, five items at Mini Wormulon Cave. And then the Ice Rod Cave, of course. Don't wanna forget that one. Just in case this is the seed where it all comes together at the Ice Rod Cave. That would be silly, but also something that RNG would certainly do to us. Ooh, we've got early mirror, which means we can do this all in one go. Excellent. That's what I like to see. Meep meep. Ooh, be in a bottle. Make sick kid another play. What about under the water? What do we got? What do we got? Oh, the boots! Oh shit! Oh my god, that's seven minute, 40 second boots! Okay, well, this is certainly a turnaround from last seed, isn't it? Oh, oh shit. Oops, there we go. Okay, I'm feeling a little bit better about this one. Uh, well, not exactly what I was going for, but works. What do we got here? Big old 20? Arrow cap, not great. Arrows, eh. Another three hundo. And the single arrow. Alright, well, run is half valid already. Plus, we got plenty of money for the Zora play. My goodness. My goodness. Got fast, well, not fast travel, but faster travel, thanks to the busy boots. Uh. Ouch. Hmm, okay, well, we've got some options. We've already got options. With a single ass rupee. How about we do front side escape? Uh, should we do front side escape? No. Let's do Bonk Rocks and Backside Escape first. <clears throat> Since we've got the boots and all, then we can do Frontside Escape if we so need. Holy heck, the items are coming fucking fast and furious here. Let's we'll see what we got. Piece of candy. Meh. Not great. Not great. 
It's no boots, and it's no hammer, and it's no glove. And no mirror, but... It's a little something something. The bonk rocks were no good. How about backside escape today? <clears throat> What do we got? The ice rod! Hey! The th oh, the moon pearl! Oh, goodness! Goodness me! Uh, that opens some things. That opens uh, just a few things for us. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Woo! Okay! Wow! That gives us a lot of options. Many options were earned this day. So front side escape is first. Obviously, clearly. It's gonna be very quick. Quick three items. Oops, soup. No, 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 no. Not, 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 the, not, not the dark room chest yet, though. We don't have the lamp. <clears throat> Oops, what do we do? <laughs> no, we're not going to fight Ega One. Come on. Come on. Getting all turned around here. I'm not used to having these items. After that last fucking seed, I'm not- ooh, nice. I used to having these items. Oof. Alright. So, we've got- we got some- got some choices to make. Some decisions. Well, there's the burrito. If we get lamp, we can do dark chest already. Which would be really nice, actually. We can mirror out and just go for it. But, uh, some strong starting items. I like that. I like to see that. In the first ten minutes, just fucking blow your mind with awesome items. That also means we could be facing a really bad item hunt later on. Another, another hundo rupees right there. And we're good on roops. We got enough money for the rest of the seed. It's crazy. First twelve minutes. Uh, to think about what's our next play here. I think maybe our next play is Dark World. To be honest. Ouch. Please die. Thank you. <laughs> that would have been embarrassing to die just there. Ah? Ah! Alright, where do we go now? Where do we go? I think we go... We go Sahash first, and then we hit start hitting Dark World, like, pretty hard. Let's see what we're dealing with, crystal-wise. Crystal, crystal pendants in Eastern. Um, five, six are at Desert, and a normal one up at Hera. Well, we can get to Hera, which is important. Plus, we can get to all the Death Mountain chests. We can break some sequence just wide on open and go up to... Go up to Hera, go up the mountain. So let's hit up Sahash first. Uh, we'll wait on Eastern, I think, for now. We're gonna hope against hope that Thieves Town is a crystal this time. It'd be real nice if it was. Because then we can get first crystal in like 20 minutes, which is crazy. Well, let's see what's in this old man's back room for now. Big old 20? Another sword! <laughs> oh dear. Okay, thank you, Sahash. Much appreci. Much appreci for that. My goodness. Alright, up the mountain. Let us go. Up the mountain. Well, Tempered Sword at 14 minutes in, that's pretty nice. I'm, I'm not gonna complain about that. Will not complain. Verily, I shall not complain about having Tempered <clears throat> this early. All right, we do need to do this dark room, so. All 
Alright, there's part one. Part two should be pretty simple. And we should be through. Eh? Yeah, nice. Really easy. I don't know why I've never... I haven't really done that very much in the past. Really simple dark room. What's the old man got for us? We're breaking sequence now. What do we got? But a piece of candy. That's fair. Ouch. Jesus. Uh, do we have... Oh, we don't have anything to do... Uh... I don't have anything to do... I, I should really learn how to do spin speed, but I, I wish I had uh, hook shot so we could do super speed right there. Oh, well. <clears throat> old man was pretty fucking worthless. Um, but we have the entire mountain open to us now. Oh my god, the hook shot is on Spectacle Rock! <laughs> oh, this is gonna be such a good sequence break. Now that my 50 roops on the inside, though. Oh dear, this is really nice. This is really nice. <laughs> damn! Uh, Disney damn, we get in hook shot. 16 minutes in. Ba -na -na -na! Excellent. Fucking excellent. Alright, I don't think, I think I forgot to mark something off here. We didn't. We did that one. Do either of those. Alright, well, oh, looks like another uh, mandatory basement visit coming up. Oh, wait. This could be a little bit of a problem, couldn't it? Because if the big key is in the basement, we can't go any further since we don't have, um, do not have a source of fire, like a lamp. All right, we're boned. We gotta, we gotta move on out of here. No items earned here. That's okay. That's all right. Figure we dip into there real quick and be done with it. Now we know we can't go back without a lamp or a fire rod. on the island, on the island we have a piece of candy. Plus now we've got the boots for Spiral Cave, so fuck yeah, out. Ouch. Much faster than walking around the entire fucking thing. Nothing but a big 20 in Spiral Cave. Well, that's alright. There's plenty of other items up here. Seven, to be exact. And if we get Titans mid up here, oh boy. We can knock out Dark Side Death Mountain right away, too. Might be helpful. Kind of taking a bit of a risk on the sequence break here, but so far it hasn't been too bad. Getting the early fucking uh, hook shot has definitely been worth it. Piece of candy. Another shield. Alright. Off the Fisher Price shield. Big old 20. Big old 20 again. And busy bands. Alright, well. Not ideal, but, you know, it's not bad either. Okay, now I think it's time to head into the Dark World. Well, there we go. Thank you. Oh, we can hit Sick Kid before we do that, though, since we got a bottle. <laughs> it's kind of an awkward... <laughs> Kind of an awkward run cycle, seeing Samus bob up and down like that. Oh well. Sick kid has a bloomerang. Eh. Eh. 
That's all right, I guess. Ooh. Oh, no, we don't have fire rod. I thought we had fire rod. Dang it. About to say, we have one rod. It's not the one I wanted. Oopsie. This ice rod is really fucking worthless. Except for Turtle Rock. Beating Trinox. If we had Fire Rod, we could knock out Skull Woods immediately. It'd be really nice. Alas, we do not have that just yet. Well, you know what? While we're up here, let's uh, check Bumper Cave. We can check Cave Above Graveyard. And we'll come back for Village of Outcasts. We got up there. Be in a bottle. Not spectacularly useful. I suppose we could still. We, oh, we can do uh, King's Tomb as well. Awesome. Doing all this shit at once. piece of candy, but whatever. It's fine. That's fine. Uh, not exactly unexpected for it to be shitty, but still would have preferred something better. <laughs> Ouch. But we in real good position to do, well, let's see what we got actually. Yeah, Thieves Town is a crystal. All right, we got crystal. It's normal crystal. We got crystal. 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 Ice is the other five sixer. And pendant pendant. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. This is a good set of pendants to have. I'd prefer Eastern to not be a pendant, but having both Meyer and T-Rock be in pendants is... Is okay. Is okay. Uh, it depends if we have to dip into them regardless because of bullshit items, but it remains to be seen, doesn't it? Oh, got our money back and then some. Thanks, fucko. the other blue mail. Alright, so then red mail now will be on Lumberjack Cave, which we are not going to go get. Because fuck that. I'm not fighting Ega 1. Oh, early ass book. Better than late ass book, that's for sure. Okay, into Thieves Town at 24 minutes and change. What can we do here is the real question. What items? Samaria, interesting. We don't necessarily need it since T-Rock and Meyer are both pendants, but it's a nice to have. It is a nice to have regardless. 
Early big key. Big 20! Not great. But it's some. Busy Bams! Also not great. But it's some. Ouch. Please. Come on, man. Don't be like that. <clears throat> uh, nice. All right. Good moves. A good hell haul. there. Oh, we don't have the hammer, so... Yeah. Fuck. Oh, no, we do have the hammer. Derp. Early hammer. Very early hammer. Excellent. Good. So... Ouch. Fuck. <clears throat> Seems we're full clear in this bitch, no matter what. Excuse me. Excuse me. Silvers! Good. Fucking great. We're not gonna be searching for those. That's the last item, so we out. To dick about with the fucking other thing. Do we? No, we don't. Means, uh, blind will have a small key for that room, and that chest will have the burrito. No, the compass. Compass, excuse me. Alright, well, early silvers, pretty early silvers again. It's great, but doesn't really mean much until we get the bow. Looking for that bow. Nice, good phase one. Ouch. Alright, reasonable phase two, I suppose. Ouch. Stop. Alright, we gotta get him. Yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> okay, good. That'll be the compass? Really? Huh. Was that all of the dungeon items? I feel like that was all of them. Let's take a quick dip back in. I want to confirm this just in case. Huh, that was all of them. Alright, well, whatever. That's Crystal 1. Shit, man. Okay, that puts us in real good position for doing some other bullshit here. We can go do Desert right away, which will be the first 5-6-er. Uh, except we don't have... I don't have a fire source, so we can't actually finish it. So maybe we don't do that just yet. But if 
50 rupees. Fuck. Alright, so we're good there. Uh, hit Old Stumpy, we'll hit Hype Cave, might hit Pyramid, and Catfish, and that'll do it for... That'll do it for all of our Dark World scramblings. Old Stumpy's got a, a big old heart for us. Thanks, Stumpy. I mean, not great, but, you know, it's something. So we'll hit the Cave South of Grove while we're here, too. Swing on by. Another hard container cave here. Right. Not bad. 20% boost to health. A span of 20 seconds. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Uh, hype cave? Uh, maybe we'll do hype cave and then bombos. And depending on what we get from all of that, let's see what we can do elsewhere. All right, Hype Cave, ready to reclaim your glory? Piece of candy. Meh. Eh? Another hard container. My goodness. Arrow cap. Titan's Mitts! All right. All right, then. That opens a few other things. <laughs> okay. Okay. Gets us a few other places. Namely, Dark Side Death Mountain. Before we do that, though, Bombos. Busy Bambos. I suppose we could dip into uh, desert while we're here, huh? Would that be a good idea? Oh, the flute. Okay. That's really good. Glad I went to Busy Bambos. Huh. <laughs> All right. Okay, Agana, you got some you got some goods for us too? While we're here? Eh? Yeah? Nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Alright, well let's check Desert Ledge. We won't go into desert just yet. Um, at least not from this side. Probably go in the back door. But we will check Desert Ledge. See if it's worth going here straight away once we activate the flute. And it is not. Okay. Hmm. All right. So now we've got a lot of options again. It's fantastic. Let's activate the flute. We'll probably go up to Dark Side Death Mountain and take care of that garbage. Because that's a lot of items. to go check Meyer first, even though Meyer is a pendant. There are still quite a few things down there. May or may not be a good idea to go grab. I mean, if it's not Quake, that's good. That keeps us out of it right away. If it is Quake, that's eh. It's Bombos. Alright, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Five sixer it must be a five sixer. It's Bombos. 
All right. Me me. Big old twenty. Me 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 me. Arrow cap. All right. It's not great, but it's something. Gets it out of the way. So we'll go check these up here. <laughs> okay, that's fine. That's fine. Gets us off the map of that. Puts us up to Death Mountain. Well, Dark Side Death Mountain. Should be more specific since there's six ish items over here. Well, not six ish, I guess, just six. But that's a lot of items. A lot of items. Plus, I guess it puts us in a position to check what we need to get into T-Rock as well. <clears throat> Which, even though it's a pendant, there's five items in there that we might need to come back for. So may as well at least check it out. The flippers! Interesting, a bee in a bottle. Huh. Flippers puts us in this swamp. Which is good. Complete that right away. It's a lot of items. Six items at our beck and call. Check T Rock real quick here. What do we got over here? Bombos again. Good. That keeps us out of T Rock. And it also keeps us out of Mimic Cave, so, you know. That works. That works on many levels for me. Visity bams. Bombo. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Bombos. Dang it. All right. Yeah, that's, that's okay though. That's okay. Standard groups. Shit. <laughs> oh dang. That's all right. Not having fire rod keeps us kind of deep out of or out of deep. Uh, T-Rock, so that's fine. Ooh, but having Bombos does put us into Ice King, or Ice Palace, Ice Palace. Which is interesting. We can do it with just Bombos instead of Fire Rod, but we'll do a few other things before then. Like Swamp and or Zora. Kind of a weird route here. We're gonna go into Dark World here. We're gonna go check. <clears throat> we go check Pyramid and Catfish, and then we're gonna mirror out and do the Zora shit, just to kind of get it all done in one go. Ouch, bird. is probably the closest portal for all this shit. If there's anything else Dark World-wise we can do... Grab this fairy. 
plus then we can grab some potions before we decide to head into ice. Just in case we need to do ice without fire rod. Nothing but a piece of candy there. Fish, what you got? The cape. All right. Well, that's an interesting thing to have. Put Spike Cave on the map for us next time we're on Dark Side Death Mountain. Bum, bum, the other single root. And a bomb cap. Waterfall of wishing leaves me wishing it had better shit. Ha 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 ha. Piece of candy on the ledge. Let's see what King Ripoff has for us today, this time around. <clears throat> Nothing but a fiver. All right. Got a 1% return. Or a negative 99% return if you want to be technically correct about it. Oh well, it's fine. We swim it in cash. It doesn't really matter. Alright. Next play is probably Swamp. Next best opportunity for some good shit. Plus, getting us access to crystal number two. Woohoo! I don't really like full clearing swamp. It is six items. Plus then we can just book on over to Ice Cave, or not Ice Cave, Ice Palace. <clears throat> Do kind of a two for one deal. chest contains blah, 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 a fiver thanks it's pretty much the one thing i don't have any use for right now is more rupees ouchie Bob, all 
What's the best Mario Kart? Oh boy. Eww. That's a rough question to ask. Ooh, the best. Oof. Man, they all got their fucking ups and downs. They all got their ups and downs. Ooh. The first one I've ever played, like, really super deep was OG Mario Kart for SNES. So I've got a special place in my heart for that one. I don't know if I'd necessarily call it the best, though. And Mario Kart 64 is real nice, but it's kind of choppy on the old frame rate. Double Dash I haven't played a whole heck of a lot of, even though it's pretty nice. Mario Kart Wii I've played the shit out of, but I'm kind of tepid on it as a whole. Mario Kart 8 is really nice, as is its pseudo-remake re-release Air Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. But I don't know if I would necessarily call it the best either. Ooh, it's a it's a really oof. Best Mario Kart is a real big toss-up. A real big toss-up. Plus, I do very much enjoy Mario Kart 7, which was the one for DS. Was it DS or 3DS? Must have been DS. Did they even, did they have one for 3DS, actually? They must have, right? They had a Mario Kart for 3DS? Uh, now I don't remember. But I remember enjoying the one for DS quite, quite much. Quite muchly. <laughs> but I don't know if I'd call that the best one either. Even though it's very good. I, I, I think, at the risk of being like a cop-out answer, I'd say that best Mario Kart is probably unanswerable. At least for now. Because it really hinges a lot- Oh! Fire Rod! Nice! Brilliant. It really hinges a lot on nostalgia. And just like being a really good series all around. Oh, nice big key there too. Okay, alright, well, we set for uh, a fire source now. Uh, bloop. Like, asking what the best Mario Kart is is probably akin to asking what the best Final Fantasy is. In the amount of fucking drama and hellfire it introduces. <laughs> if that makes any sense. Um... Big old 20! But yeah, I, I wouldn't even know what my favorite Mario Kart is, to be honest with you. There's so many that are so good to me that I don't think I could, um, I could pick an absolute 100% objective frontrunner. Alright, well having Fire Rod really opens this up for us. <clears throat> If you said, let's play Mario Kart, which one would I reach for? Ooh. Ooh, that's an interesting way to pose that question. Hmm. Hmm. I would probably then say Mario Kart 64. That That's that's how I would answer that. That's a very interesting way to put that, actually. Very clever. Very clever. Very clever. ba -na -na -na. Uh, I forgot to mark off at least one item. Are we still missing? Nope. All right, so Argus will have the last item, I think. And I, I think I think I say, oopsie, I needed to grab that key. I think I say Mario Kart 64 because that was probably the last one where it wasn't too complicated, but it was still like, uh, how to put this? Not too complicated, but still, like, developed enough where it was a really super solid game. Really super solid. 
Oh, seven was the 3DS one. They had a separate Mario Kart. All right, both of those are really solid, actually. Really solid mobile Mario Kart titles. I think the only, probably the only thing I dislike about seven, or was it was it seven or was it DS? Um, either one of those. Uh, the one of the carts was able to do the whole snaking thing down straightaways, which really fucking ruined online play for it. Which is really kind of an unfortunate part of it. Because I think the online play for both of them was really solid, too. Oh, we got busy bams for the last one. Alright. There's crystal number two. Two crystals in. We're less than an hour. That's good. That's really nice. Okay, unfortunately we do not have a lamp just yet, but now we can go do Hera and Skull Woods and Ice. Let's go do Ice. Let's go do Ice. Since we're in the area, maybe it'll have um, maybe it'll have a lamp for us. At which point that blows the rest of this just wide the fuck open, really. So lamp and bow, and then I oopsie, what am I doing? I need to be in the light world for this. Lamp and bow, and then we'll be in go mode. Which is real. Oh, nice. <laughs> I managed to get on a cliff with that. Brilliant. Just the best. Alright, so we're gonna do. Oh, well, not, not, not a fire rodless ice anymore, which is great. Um, we're gonna do this real quick, like... Oopsie. Oh, I probably should remember to bring a potion. Eh, I'm sure it's fine. odd that you like Mario Kart and Smash Bros over racing and uh, fighting games. I don't think it's that odd. Oops, oh shit, I fucked up. Nice. Alright, can we get this guy at least? Eh? Oh yeah, alright. We got the fucking backup strats. <laughs> I don't think it's that odd, because I, I would consider both Mario Kart and Smash not to be like purest racing games or purest fighting games, I guess. Would probably be the appropriate way to say just for like really minor differences though. Like I still consider them racing and fighting games, just not like what I would what I would go to as a racing or a fighting game. Perfect. Oh man, two first try Ice Palace bomb jumps. That's ridiculous. At least we're on point with that. Oopsie. Okay. There we go. Boom ba 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 da 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 ba Oh, oh, certainly. I agree that they are much more fun iterations of racing and fighting games. Like, no argument there. Absolutely. Do I have the big key? I don't have the big key yet, do I? Oh. Ba -do -do -ding. Ba -da -da -da. Oh. I was hoping that would be the big key so we wouldn't have to backtrack to this, but I guess we need to go over here anyways, so no biggie. Ba-ba-da-da. Ba-ba-da-da. 
I'm not gonna get caught by the anti fairy garbage there. Well, I guess a small another small key is actually pretty good. Need one to get through here, we'll need one to get through the other door. I just wonder if I should go through that door instead. Not well, that's necessarily any faster. Ow. Leads to actually. Huh. Oh, shovel. Interesting choice. That's an interesting choice. Gonna be vanilla big key again. Cat, all right, that's the final item. for this. Oh well. It's fine. Jeez, we'll have three crystals less than an hour in. That's fucking crazy. Zealous there. Nice, did we do it? Oh, brilliant. Woo, that was cutting a little close. All right, we'll take that. That was a pretty solid fight. There's Crystal 3. Okay. All right, that's what I like to see right there. All right, I think we head up now to Skull Woods. Knock that crystal one out. Kind of just keep on rolling and hope that we can grab a lamp and a bow at some point. Those are the two things that are holding us back. Skull Woods and Hera are two more dungeons we can knock out. Both crystals. It's great. Hopefully we find the bow. Lamp on the way somewhere. Ah, Splatoon. Yeah, I've heard a lot of good things about that. 
I haven't tried it myself. I'm not really all that interested in it. Because I'm not really a big fan of multiplayer shooters to begin with. But hey. Trips the trigger for a lot of folks, it seems. Whoa, careful. Although I do remember liking, uh... Liking, uh, Modern Warfare. COD 4, Modern Warfare 1, or whatever. I do remember liking that one quite a bit. It felt very good to me, gameplay-wise. Alright, I don't have the big key yet, so this is gonna be a bit problematic. Looks like we're not gonna worry about the big key for now. But we don't need the big key to go fight Mothula, so whatever! Doesn't matter! We even have Samaria to make this next room really fucking simple. And there's the second item, so we're not diving for it. Just gonna grab this small key real quick and then we can just go right for Mothula. Ouch. Oh, fucking. Stupid ceiling master. Arr. If I can use. Oh, wait, I don't have a bow. Never mind. Ah! Let's say, I wonder if I can use arrows on Mothula. Doesn't matter, does it? No bow with which to use them. Ow. Uh, swing sword, please. Thank you. and hope they hit point first. <laughs> if only. I mean, I've got silvers. You'd think they'd do some damage, right? You would think. Care about because it's gonna have the compass or the burrito. There's crystal four. They're chunking away at this. That's what I like to see. Unfortunately, we can get into both Meyer and T Rock. Uh, which is unfortunate. But uh, we're just gonna keep chunking away at crystal dungeons until we've got no other choice. And heck, we've got the book, we're up at MSP, let's take a quickie peek. Not that I expect anything of value will be in here. Couch cash, excellent. It's probably 20 roops or 5 roops or something like that. So no MSP seed tonight. tab while we're up here, and if we so chose, we could do Spike Cave as well. Maybe we'll do that once we get out of Hera. Just to be sure. 
that there's nothing of critical value in there. It does happen more than once. I've had actually Lamp and Spike Cave more than once, which is really shitty. It's such a shitty place for it to be. Come on, bow! Damn! <laughs> Ammo for the bow. Partially there. This is going to turn into hunting for the one single item I need, which is going to be the bow, probably. Oopsie. Eh -heh. There we go. Fortunately, we have collected many of the other items in a, in a pretty good order. Like, we haven't been blocked, we haven't had to double dip into anything. Well, I guess Hera, I suppose we're double dipping into, but... It hasn't been too much of a shit show this time around. This will be big key here. One of them's still dead. Interesting. Figured they would all respawn after that. So we've got all the equipment to go for all the items without any risky ass bomb jumps. So this should be a pretty quick Tower of Hera. takes care of those. We can... Oh yeah, we can clear out desert. Nice. Alright, so we got even one more crystal dungeon after this to take care of. Pod is the only one that's left to us, which requires the bow, so... In... Ugh. Really quick fight. Easy peasy. Fuck you, Wormulon. That is crystal number five. Beautiful. It's looking real good. Ether tab with some bullshit. Let's check Spike Cave on our way down, and then we will head on over to Desert, I guess. And then check some overworld locations and see if we can't find the bow. Oh, it's savings time now, isn't it? Oh shit, you're right. That is in a couple hours, isn't it? Fuck. Ah, uh, it's so dumb. I don't know why we keep doing that bullshit twice a year. I have the idea of the cape, right? I really wish we would just get rid of it, to be honest with you. But that is out of our hands, isn't it? But yes, you're right. It is daylight savings time this weekend. It's when it changes. Ah, uh, the bug net. Okay. At least a partially useful item. Alright, where do we want to go? We want to hit up... I guess it really doesn't matter. We're going to go to desert first, probably. We'll go in the back door since that's going to be the fastest to clear this shit out. So, if we find the bow, this is going to be a pretty gosh-dying-good pace. 
but we're kind of running out of places for it to be in a convenient... Running out of very convenient places for it to be, I should say. Um, but if it is in the Desert Palace, that would be the best. That would really be the best case at this point. So maybe if it's on the torch? <laughs> Wouldn't that be just be the thing? Dang it. Alright, well, the key's on the torch. Still got, we got two chances for the bow to be in here. Out of many, many chances elsewhere, so... Not exactly playing the odds with this. Piece of candy. Boo. But... We have very little choice otherwise. We could actually pop into Eastern and see if it's in there. Might be a good place for it to be. With a burrito! The big key! It's faster to get her out and do this this way. Although I probably should have grabbed that fairy. Oh well. It's fine. <gasps> the bow! Oh shit! Oh my goodness! We are in go mode now! Oh, you gotta go to bed? Alright, thanks for stopping by. See you later. Oh goodness, we are on fantastic pace now. Oh, I can't believe. I cannot believe what we are up to now. <laughs> Woo! Okay! Oh dear. We are in go mode now. My goodness, that's ridiculous. That is some ridiculous shit to pull right there. Mmm, boy. Everything is indeed coming up Millhouse with this. Oh, shit. Okay, let's do this, man. Let's do it. I don't want to say anything about whether this is going to be PP. Oh, wait, we don't have the lamp. Shit, the lamp is the other thing. Wait, what is the, uh... Oh, pod. Oh, we could... Oh, we could try. We could try... Without lamp. We could try without lamp. Uh, but that'd be really dangerous. Never mind. We might not be in go mode. Never mind. Um, I, I called it a little bit prematurely. Oh, shit. I'm missing every goddamn shot here. Ah, oh, crap. Ow, hit him. God damn it. Oh, getting too excited here. Dang it. Oh, we're missing the lamp now, which is unfortunate at this point. <laughs> the lamp is going to be the last thing. Oh, no. Oh, dang it. Oh, the lamp. We don't need lamp for Ganon's tower, and I'm trying to think of all of the dark rooms in pod. Do we go without the lamp? And do we just say, fuck it? Ah, oh, I think we do. I think we go to pod right now. And we hope that we find the lamp on the way. But if we don't, it probably is not the, la the worst thing in the world. Ah, oh, damn. Dip damn Daru. This is, uh... Oh, okay. We're gonna try. We're gonna try Pod without the lamp. Because this could be an amazing run. If we can pull this off. Oh, -ho. I'm really taking a big risk here. Dip damn Daru. This is gonna be one heck of a run if we can do this. Because G Tower... Does G Tower have dark rooms? I don't think it does. I really don't think it does. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. It doesn't... Does it? I've always had lamp when going through G Tower, so I don't really know if it does or not. I don't think it does. I don't think it does. Well, we're gonna try this. We're gonna try this without... Without lamp, and we'll see how it goes. 
I mean, really, if we get bi if we get big keys super early, I'm not even gonna bother. I'm just gonna fucking peace out and <laughs> just say fuck it. Big old twenty there. That kind of sucks, but eh, we'll see what happens. If we can get big key, preferably before any of the dark rooms in this in this uh, dungeon, that'd be great. Because I'm pretty sure we can do the last set of dark rooms without much issue. Ah, dang, this is gonna be real tight. <laughs> This is going to be real tight if we can pull this off. My goodness. Well, as soon as we see... Oh, there's the lamp. All right. We're 100% go mode now. <laughs> oh, it doesn't even matter. Ah, shit. Oh, this is real nice. Doesn't even matter. Saved by the fucking lamp right there. This is gonna be a small key. Oh, goodness. Shit, son. If ever there was a seed to have after the garbage that was the previous one, this is the one to have. Holy heck. Another small key! Oh, do we risk going back? I think we, we, have, we have to go back and check the other ones, otherwise we're probably not gonna miss the big key. Oh man, this makes me so happy now. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, this is making me so happy now. Goodness. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. All right. Damn, this is another small key. Hopefully, if the big key is down here, that'd be real nice. Hint, hint, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Big key, please. Ah? Ah! <laughs> ah, damn. <laughs> All right, it's okay, it's okay. Pod isn't the hardest, isn't the longest dungeon to go through, so. We on still really super good pace, which is making me super happy. Like, even if G-Tower dicks us about super hard. Oops, I don't know why I used a key there. That one's kind of silly. Eh, fuck it. Even if G-Tower dicks us about super hard, uh, we are on real good pace, probably for PB. Which is nuts. Which is super nuts. Oh, don't have big key. Alright, let's go right side first then. We will still need one small key. Well, that kind of seals it right there. <clears throat> Come on, looking for the big key, for gosh sakes. No, not another small key. Oh, uh, dang it. Well, I will say this will be the brilliantest seed in so much as we don't have to go into any of the pendant dungeons. There's Keen and Brian. Oops. Uh, bloop. All right. Oof. Big key, please show yourself to me. Thank you. <laughs> All right, we fucking out of here. Oh, this is super brilliant. I think we can still pull a... <clears throat> we can still pull a... Um, a time gain out of this... Out of this final crystal here, if we really book it. Might be a little tight. We've got all the gear. We don't have Butter Sword, which will make the Ganda fight a little bit longer, but that's okay. That's all right. We can we can work with that. We won't be doing spin strats. We won't be doing silverless. The only thing standing between us now is the G Tower big key and hopefully not a an unkind gauntlet.
All right, this is this is really nice. Couldn't have asked for a better <coughs> a better second seed here. Sore. All right, so we didn't quite recover as much as we had hoped, but still, but still, really fancy. Oh, and half magic. Oh, that's probably the best thing we could have had besides butter sword right there. Dang. All right, it's looking nice. It's looking real nice. Oof. <laughs> Okay, all right. Get the fuck up to Death Mountain. Damn, fucking squirrel. Oh, come on, really? The one th Ugh, the one thing that could get in my way yet. Eat a shit. Out of my way, fucko. Tower could still troll us pretty hard where we lose a few minutes, but it's looking really good. It's looking real fine. Ooh, actually, good part to have. Let's see. Get rid of all of our bees. I should have grabbed. I should have grabbed a potion or something. Oh well. We'll be fine with a backup fairy. time save there, <laughs> just for good measure. Ah, eat a shit, T-Rock. Nobody going into you tonight. Oh, boy. Oh, man, this is the best. G-Tower by Buck23. Goodness, goodness, goodness me. Hmm. All right. I think I'm going to go right side first, just in case. Just in case Big Key happens to be over there. Because holy heck, that would just be the thing to do tonight. Take another risk. Take another risk, man. Oh, beautiful. Almost pixel perfect there, too. Alright, place your bets. 1 through 22. What do we got? Small key is fine. Damn. <laughs> I was really hoping for Big Key there. <laughs> All right, one and two, one and two. Small key on the torch, we'll grab that. There's number three. Small keys for days. Four through seven. Four. Busy bank. Five. Big old 20. Six. Magic powder. Okay, that's good to have. Seven is another big old 20. Okay, well, powder's actually a really good thing to have. We can get some backup fairies and shit. Seven, ten. 
20? Oh, 20 is a bad guess. No, why? <laughs> Alright, what was that? That was 8, right? Oopsie. We'll early fire on that one. This will be nine. Piece of candy. All right, good refill there at least. Ten through uh, ten through thirteen coming up. Had to math a little bit. Ten. Big big old shield. Eleven. Big twenty. Twelve. Burrito. Thirteen. Oh shit. Okay. Uh, not looking so good for G Tower today. <laughs> Fifteen. <laughs> Just keep on guessing, I guess. Why not? Oh, one more pixel. Ah, fucked it up. That's all right. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> uh, all right, so we're coming up on 14. I guess this is the last chance before we get kind of mad about this. Because please. Oh, there's ether, at least. Grab another backup fairy while we're sitting in here. There's 14. Ooh, wow. Uh, didn't expect to hit that one, actually. Yeah, eat shit, Armos. What you got? Alright, 15 through 17. 15. The butter. Interesting. 16, 17. Oh, shit! Oh, it's right hand side. That's so garbage. Gosh dang it. Ah, uh, why? Why, why, why? If it's Tile Room, that would really suck. Please don't be Tile Room. Please don't be Tile Room. Got that, we got that. Whoop, easy. Ouch. Ouch. Right. This guy needs to stop bouncing his butt around here. Thank you. Oops, uh, shit. Well, I'm gonna need to find another small key somewhere, at least. Even if it is in tile room. Ugh. Ouch. Oof. Getting beaten back and forth by these damn tiles. Ow, stop it! Rock. Rock. Alright, well. Small key I need it anyways. is going to be the last effing group of chests. That sucks. I forget what number we're on. I guess this will be 18 through 20. Wait, what am I doing? Why am I tossing bombs like a big dumb idiot? Well, it actually worked. Uh, this will be 19 through 20. Or 19 through 22. 19! 20! 20! 20, 20, 20! 20 gets it. Nice. Good guess. Good ass guess. What a pro. One single guess. A mega weapon gets it. Congrats, man. Congrats, my bro. My dude. Alright, we out of there. G Tower being a bit of a fucking idiot. Not great pal friend. By sticking it in the last gosh dang room I check. 
course. But whatever, we still got the gauntlet to go. Uh, looks like we should still be on pace for a PB. Maybe not a great PB. Maybe not a, maybe a couple minute PB. It's certainly not as good as I would hope. I was hoping, like, right when we got the lamp, but it still looks to be a, a couple minute PB at the very least. Assuming the patterns on Jerk Wizard the second aren't super douchey. Whoa, nice run. And a good D-boost at the end there, too. Oh, come on, really? Stupid. D-boost on through. Yeah, boy! Yeah, eat shit, Skeleton. Ah, get him. Oh. <laughs> what a shot. Get him! Oh, nice! <laughs> two for two. Zoof. Not a bad gauntlet. Not a bad gauntlet at all. Alright, if we could one cycle Landmo 2 here, that would be really fucking fly. No, not gonna do it. Because of fucking rocks and lag and shit everywhere! Ah! God damn it. Come on, hit something! Fireballs thrown up. What the hell was that? Ah! Dirty ass four cycle is what it is. There. Stupid fucking fireballs. Messing with my steez. Oh well. When did we get ether? Did I get ether? I guess I picked up ether at some point. Powder. Nice. Good shooting. Excuse me, fellas. Don't mind me. Dang it. Oh, that would have been so good if we had hit the last one. Two for four. land it on the fucking one pixel of the wall where it's not gonna fucking move. Garbage bullshit is that. Alright, Wormulon Dose. Come eat some shit. Yeah, that's right. You like it, don't you? All right, validation chest holds. Ooh, damn. If that would have been Sank Heart, that would have been the best. But hey, we'll take another heart just because. Eh, okay, not a bad hell hallway. All right, Trick Wizard the second. Please give us some good patterns. It's not a bad set of patterns there. Oh, and I miss them all because I get sword swiped. Arr! Asshole. And then blue ball. Thanks, bucko. There's one. And blue ball again. Thanks. All right. Two. God damn it. Four. Okay, thank you. 
second five. Six. Oh. All right. Not the greatest Jerk Wizard second fight, but could have been worse. Asshole. <laughs> All right, we're going straight into this. No breaks. No breaks, no fairies, no potions. Let's go. Actually, no, I do have two fairies. No potions. But we do have half magic and over half of it left, so we should be good. We good to go. And if we pull a sub 140 out of this... Damn, son! Into Ganon, but buck 36. Cheese. Well, there's one of them. All right, that should be phase three, I think. That was quite a number of hits I put upon his backside. Out, cheese. Quick phase three would be really good. Ah, you coward. Alright, good. Yeah, alright, wasn't bad. Only three little coward teleports going on there. Uh, I don't know if that will get the torch glitch. Nope. Oh crap, I missed him. Ah, you bastard. Again. Nice! Double the finisher, though. That's good. Oh boy, look, we're looking at a buck thirty-eight. That's ridiculous. Oh! <laughs> Holy shit! Buck thirty-seven. 49. That, that is what I needed after that first seed. Jesus. That's nuts. Now, if G Tower wasn't such a bitch, that could have been like a buck 35, buck 34, maybe buck 33. That could have been much nicer at the end, but. You know what? I ain't gonna complain about this. I ain't gonna complain about it because it's pretty nice. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Can't believe I improved my PB. Well, I'm kind of surprised it happened tonight too. I knew we could do better than Buck 42. I mean, that, that doesn't surprise me. The fact that I could do a PB doesn't surprise me. The fact that it was tonight, kind of surprising. Make sure we save the shit out of this. Oof. All right. Well, that was that was really nice. We had a good start, and then we just kind of blazed a trail through it all the way through. Crystal one and about half an hour through, we never turned back. Well, we turned back once, I guess. I don't know what happened here. I think we were searching overworld and shit, but then we never fucking looked back. Boom! 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 boom. Oh, so good. Really fucking proud of this one. There was a couple bad execution areas. Uh, routing through G Tower was kind of shitty, but then again, it being in the final room on the right side is super dumb. <coughs> but other than that, that was pretty good. We did, we took a risk 
in doing the sequence break up to Death Mountain early uh, without having the lamp. But fuck, it paid off. That hook shot being on Spectacle Rock. Mmm. Mmm. Just the best. Chef's kiss right there. Didn't have to go into any of the pendant dungeons even once. Just fucking fucking so good. That's the way it should go. That is always the way it should go. Never make me dip my butt into any of those worthless dungeons. <coughs> and the and the pendant dungeons being the way they were, both Meyer and T Rock. Oh man, not having to go into those is great. Eastern, I'm kind of eh. If we were to replace another one of the Dark World dungeons with the Pendant, I'd probably go for Ice. Like, the last three dungeons are just bullshit. But everything else lined up pretty well for us. My goodness. Happy about that. Happy about that. Alright, let's see what the stats are up. Let's see what the stats are all about for this, this, this one here, and then we'll call it a night. Oh, boy. Right. Early sword again, which is great. Super early boots, which is nice. Super early mirror. Hammer was really early. Didn't have to dick about with uh, baby's first sword or even the master sword for too long. No deaths. Super good. Not too many bonks either considering how early we got the boots. And that's a much better collection rate right there. 150s instead of 180s. The greatest. The greatest. All right. There we go. <laughs> oh, wow. A four, almost a five-minute improvement. That's insane. That's insane. <clears throat> All right, but that's it for tonight. Next stream will be tomorrow night, 7 p.m. CDT. Since we're hitting uh, daylight savings in about two and a half hours here. Ugh. Losing an hour. Whatever. Uh, tomorrow night, 7 p.m. CDT, we'll be on Assault Android Cactus Speedrun Practice. And then Monday night, 7 p.m. CDT, we'll be back on Hollow Knight. Finishing that off next week. Next week will also be a short week because of podcast on Friday. Uh, so we'll probably just stick to Hollow Knight for the entire week, I think. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.